Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. The document view buttons are a group of five buttons located in the lower right corner of the application. You can click these buttons to change the working view of your document. By default, Word will open in Print Layout View, which is the view most commonly used for standard document creation. Unless otherwise specified by the lesson, you can assume that the document view referenced in the lessons of this tutorial will refer to the Print Layout View. This view allows you to see the document in the manner in which it will appear when printed. This view shows margins, page breaks, and header and footer information. However, you can switch between the different views of a document as needed. Each has its own use within the program. The different document views are print layout, full screen reading, web layout, outline, and draft. As with any document, you should select the view that works best for the document that you are trying to execute. For example, if you are trying to use Microsoft Word to create a blog entry, then you may want to view it in the Web Layout view. Since we have already discussed the function of the Print Layout view, let's review the purpose of the various other document views that are available. Full Screen Reading view is used to maximize the amount of space available for reading the document. This view is useful for electronically reading and reviewing a document. The Web Layout view is used when creating documents that are intended to be published to the web. Outline view can help you organize the hierarchy of ideas within a master document, such as an outline or an agenda. The draft view focuses on the body of text that comprises the majority of most documents. You will not see any other additional information such as the margins or the header and footer data when working in the draft mode. Also note that you can select the View tab in the ribbon and then click the command buttons that appear within the Document Views group to switch between the various views of a document. This is simply another way of switching between the document views. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.